Welcome back to another edition of Vikings Film Room, brought to you by the Vikings Entertainment Network. I'm your host, Pete Bursich. Now in the sixth round with the 184th selection, Minnesota Vikings select offensive tackle Vidarian Lowe out of the University of Illinois. Now, Vidarian has one of the greatest stories I've seen as a young man coming into the NFL, coming out of the draft. If you don't know about him, take some time and look it up. But here in the film room, we just look at what they do on the field. So let's take a look at the film and see what Vidarian Lowe brings to the table. Now, when we watch film on Vidarian Lowe, what you're gonna see is a big man, because you can't coach big, you can't coach size, but you can't coach speed and good feet either. And Vidarian Lowe possesses a lot of speed for a tackle and has tremendous, tremendous footwork. You'll see a lot of examples of him getting in the second level in a lot of these plays. Now, this is just a zone. He's gonna step up and get the linebacker. His initial step is beautiful. Head placement, pads down low, pushes this linebacker past the play and opens up for a big run. So a very athletic offensive tackle. All right, so we saw him on the zone getting to the second level, but sometimes you're gonna get a big body in the way. So this is the double team getting up to the second level. Great example, again, great footwork. Gets that head in, jars that defensive lineman, gets him out of the gap and then works his way up to that second level. He keeps going to open up that cutback and watch him finish right here. All the way down the field till the whistle blows. So that is a tremendous job by Vidarian Lowe. Now this is a great example of what really makes him special. And that's his ability to get up the field, the speed, the athleticism. In this case, it's again, another zone play. He has really this area and whoever comes in, but this is a safety coming down the field. The speed to catch up to the safety, this safety doesn't get by him. And then he stays on him and pushes him all the way off of the frame. That is an athletic block and a great finisher. Okay, another example of, of a zone blitz. Again, the footwork, the getting out of his stance and getting outside, is it's tremendous. So the beautiful, everyone's blocking this way. You're gonna get everybody stepping this way. You see how quick he is out of his stance, gets to the double team, and he's gonna stay on this the whole time. It's up to the other guy to get off on that second level, but they took their guy to the ground. So beautiful job. Now, why is footwork so important? It's the ability to redirect because defensive linemen don't always just stand where they started. In this case, again, a zone play to the outside. He's going to try to reach on number 15. This outside linebacker is going to decide, I'm going to come underneath, but watch for Darian Lowe. Let's that guy go, gets his feet right, and pins in the linebacker. So this stunt is absolutely going nowhere. The athleticism, the footwork, quick feet. That's what makes Vidarian Lowe a very good prospect. Okay, coach, so we've seen him in space, but what about the down blocks? What about the dirty stuff that you have to do? You'll see him here having to block down on this defensive tackle. This is block this guy down and move him out of the way. And you'll see on the snap, great footwork, gets that head, the shoulders are down, stays on his block. It takes the guy all the way to the ground. So he can do some of the dirty work too. So with an athletic to offensive tackle, you're gonna to wanna to see him pull. Now, this is my favorite play that we found on this young man, not just because of how it starts, but how he finishes it. You'll see pulling the tackle. This takes some athleticism here. He's gonna pull all the way across this formation, gets to the point of attack and hits this linebacker, but watch, takes him to the ground, and then what? He just gets fat on him, stays on him. He's letting that guy know, I got you all day. You're not going anywhere. Love that about the Darian Lowe. Well, what about pass protection? Well, that's, unbelievably important this day and age. And usually this is one of the highest paid defenders on the field, so he's gonna be good. Again, Vidarian Low, great feet, athletic. Needs some technique work. You'll see him get off this ball, good feet. Looks like he's getting himself beat, got those shoulders turned, needs to keep him a little more square, but has the recovery speed to push him by the quarterback. All right, another example of athleticism in the pass protection game. You're gonna get on here a play action type pass Vidarian Lowe gets himself back. Now he doesn't get too far out. He stays up on him, stays on that shoulder, stays with him and pushes him around the quarterback, keeping the pocket. So great job moving his feet. He has the athleticism to get to some of these faster defensive players. All right, another great example of athleticism in the passing game, lined up against the outside linebacker. This linebacker has a two way go. He doesn't always have to go around the outside but to protect the outside, you've got to get off, but they have to have a foot in the ground to be able to redirect, and he does this beautifully. As a big man, gets himself up the field, recognizes that stunt, comes back down, and actually gets himself back in front of that defensive lineman. So great athleticism on the outside. 
Now, what Fedarian Lowe possesses are the things that coaches can't teach. He has the athleticism, he has the great feet, he also has speed for an offensive tackle. Fedarian Lowe's challenge is gonna to be to get bigger and to get stronger, so he can hold up on these double teams, blocking some of the best defenders in the NFL on the outside. Again, if you know this young man like I do, you've seen what he's already accomplished in this life. I put my money on the fact that Vidarian Lowe is gonna develop into a good football player.